Well, my friends, look what I have here on the RC Workstation. I got a little bit of a project build for the new Axial SCX-10 II. I'm going to be changing out the body shell, the rims, the shocks, and the tires, my friends. So a little bit of an overhaul, nothing really too crazy right now. So let's talk about what is all here, okay? So first off, I had the 1946 Dodge Power Wagon from ProLine Racing. Really cool looking body. That's it's got that old school uh, vintage look to it. Uh, really dig this body. And uh, as far as like color wise, I hadn't really decided what color I'm actually going to go with. Um, I might do some classic look or some rusted look. I really don't know, my friends. I really don't need it yet. Uh, so right here we got the uh, some stickers. So we got the masking tape for the windows, and we got some bolts and nuts to uh, put the uh, the bed on, which is a separate part. So like you can do away with the band, just have like a flat bed on the back maybe, or put this one on here. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do if I if I'm gonna do this right here or or go with the kind of flat bed thing. I don't know yet. I don't know yet. <laughs> All right, also right here you see is the uh, light buckets assembly where you can actually have lights on it, which I do have lights from the Jeep Wrangler there that I can put on there. So uh, that would be pretty cool. Uh, that one thing I have noticed, there's no instructions on exactly how to put the body together, but it's fairly easy. It definitely got some markings there where the bolts go at, so that's not a big issue, you know. <laughs> All right, so the next thing here is uh, some new rims. These are the 1.9 G-Made uh, True Beadlock rims. It's a three-piece kit that goes onto the tires. Now, uh, the shocks here are these, uh, let me try to zoom up there, are these uh, hot racing black internal spring air shocks, 100 millimeters, nice black and chrome feature. Uh, really cool looking shocks. So I uh, can't wait to actually, you know, Try these out and see how they do. And also, I got a set of 1.9 Super Swamper TSL XLs. So a little bit larger tire, and uh, so that's gonna be really nice to put on there and uh, really scale this thing out. So yeah. <laughs> so uh, hope y'all jo uh, join me on this uh, this little uh, overhaul build project for the SCX10 too. I think it's gonna be pretty awesome. So yeah. All right, my friends. Well, I'm gonna let y'all go. And uh, please subscribe if you have not. Like this video, comment if you got any questions, whatever. And I will see y'all in the next upcoming video of this.